will not stop loving you. I wish you could be mine. gone but I still love and miss you so much Business as usual. Just give me like um, two. Just give me a while, I'll call you back, okay? All right. Okay. Bye bye. Sorry, I have to go back to the office. You haven't even opened your food yet. I know, but it's really important. They need me there now. Please, I'm so sorry. Please. Don't. You should eat at least. Dave. Oh, God. Open the gate. Oba, you don't come out? No, I want fried rice. Idiot. Oba, open the gate. Okay, sir. Sorry, sir.
come in. Ah. Franco. Ben, what's up? I told you over the phone that I could handle this. So why did you come back? Well, I don't think you could handle this the way I wanted. Ben, this is not me undermining your capabilities. Because I know you're very good at what you do. But Dreamstar wants a flawless presentation. And they believe that this can be achieved if I do it myself. <laughs> but at least you, you could have given yourself some time. I mean, I was surprised because your secretary told me you were driving home for lunch. Well, not until you called and I had to reschedule and postpone my lunch. <sighs> it's alright. Uh, now you're here, can I have the files for Dolphins Oil and Gas? Dolphins Oil and Gas? Oh, yeah. Just, just a minute, let me forward it to your email. Oh, okay. You know, Ben, it's always an amazing feeling anytime I come here, you know? I know, right? <laughs> I tell you. <laughs> yeah, but, yeah, but you know, man, this time around, um, I have to be completely honest with you. Honest? Honest about what exactly? About this place? Oh. Uh, oh, about <laughs> you, Frank. Of course, yes, yeah, please go ahead. Please. Yeah, what is it? Sure. Frank, I observed you have not been spending enough time with your new wife. Says who? Of course, I've been spending a lot of time with Amara. Why would you even say that? You did not observe your honeymoon after your wedding. You always come out here to join me with some bottles until it's like midnight. I mean, Frank, if I'm your true friend, I have to be completely honest with you. Um, Ben, can I ask you a question, please? Go ahead. Why are you drinking pills for another man's headache? Did Amara ever complain to you that she was lonely or feeling dejected in any way? Listen, Frank, all I'm saying is you need to be spending more time with her. I mean, put yourself in her shoes. Imagine Amara after the wedding and she always like goes out with her friends to hang out till midnight. How would you feel about that? <laughs> For real. A lady I married from the village. Amara would not even dare. Don't even go there. Don't even suggest it, please. Okay? She would not. She would never dare. It's not fair. I mean, don't you guys want to have kids? I mean, how do you plan on going about it? Uh, <laughs> okay. I see where this is heading. But please, can I beg you for a favor? I would really appreciate it if we never ever talk about my family again. Not in this manner. Please. Let's not do it. I came here to have fun. Alright? We came here to have fun. Let's not spoil it. Would you please oblige me every time we come out here to have fun? Do not speak about my family in this manner. Okay? Would you oblige me and not talk about this again? I mean, I'll be praying for you, my friend. I'll be praying for you also. <laughs> yeah. Bye, man. Yeah. Another one, please. This is not what I want in my life I'm just living like a prisoner of love This is not what I want in my life My heart 
Hey. Honey. Sita, how are you? I'm fine. You're back. Yes, I am, darling. I don't know. How was your day? It was fine, babe. Yeah. You didn't touch your food. Oh, sweetheart. Uh, I'm sorry. It's very late. I don't know. Yeah. I tried to watch my weight and all that. Mm -hmm. It's very late. It's very late to be in the system. So, let's go to bed. Uh, oh, no, no, no. There's a project I need to finish before I go to bed. Please. Babe. Babe, come on. I need you. Oh, no, no. Oh, don't do this. This project, I need to finish it because I have to submit it at the board meeting tomorrow. Why are you doing this to me? Why? It's always work, work, work. You work at the office, you come back home and you walk, you won't touch me, you won't even look at me. What is all this now? Drop this laptop, let us go to bed. This is not what I want in my life. Have you been talking to Ben? I'm just leaving. Are you, are you supposed to be talking to them? Babe, what is wrong with you? Isn't that what the father spoke to us in our marriage class about? That we should never bring a third party into our marriage? Why would you be doing this? Talk to Ben, how? I don't understand what you're saying. I haven't spoken to anyone about our marriage. I wouldn't do that, but come on, babe. It's choking me. I need you. For how long will I keep bottling this up? Huh? All right. Let me say something. Let's say, okay, I give you all the attention that you need. I give you all the care. I provide for you, you know, give you 20 rounds in bed. I'm sure that's what you want, right? If I do all that, who is going to take care of the bills? Who is going to work and bring in money for the house? You know, I didn't mean it in that context. I just need you to look at me. I am your wife. I am tired. I just need you. Is that too much to ask? I I need my wife to understand that I need to work and that if I don't work, who's going to pay the bills in the house? We have a project, a building project. I have to complete it. If I don't work, who's going to pay the rent here? Okay, it's fine.
you know, earlier on today, just before you came back. I tried the ice cream that you made yesterday. Wow, it was really tasty. Should we try one? Let's just share one before we go to bed. What do you think, my love? Smile for me, please. <laughs> Amara, my darling. Okay, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's try one before we go to bed, okay? Oh, there you are. My sweetheart, what's up? <laughs> I've been looking for you everywhere. You miss me? Well, of course, I yes. I know you miss me. <laughs> I miss my husband. Of course, I do. Well, babe, you know it's weekend. Yeah, sure. I'm about to make lunch. So I was hoping you'd come join me in the kitchen. You know, help me out a little bit, please. No. No, sweetheart, come on, don't do this. Why are you fond of doing this? You never ever let me have my, my peace and sanity. I came out here just to receive fresh air. And you want to spoil my joy and kill my joy? I don't know you like this. You know what? What you need is a help. No. Yes. That's what you do need. And I'll get a, a help for you. You need assistance in the kitchen. No, babe. It's not like that. Hmm? So what is it exactly? I just need my husband to, to be in the kitchen with me. Just help me slice onions while I blend tomatoes. Okay, you know what? You don't even have to do anything. Just come and keep me company. We can actually have that chat here. What you need to do now is go in there, grab a chair, and we can sit down here and talk. That reminds me. There's this business idea I've been thinking about for weeks. We can actually brainstorm about it. What do you think? We are going to starve. No, we're not going to starve. Okay, let's say we get hungry later on. We can actually drive out and get something to eat. Why are you walked up? I just need you to stay with me in the kitchen, that's all. It's, it's not too much to ask. And I just need you to come here and have a chat with me. It's not too much to ask, too. Excuse me, guys. Hey, Mike, what's up? Oh, yes, I'm good. Okay. Are you referring to the business proposal? Oh, okay, yeah, sure. Um, I will be there in the next um, 10 minutes. Actually, I, I can make it five. Yes, I'm very close to you. Take care. Yeah, oh, oh, you're going out? Yes, I'm going out. Uh, there's this proposal that Mike and I have been working on for weeks. We have to submit it by Monday. So he needs me to, um, you know, come so today, I can give him my Today, Saturday. Yes, he wants me to come over to the office. Uh, sorry, not the office, actually. He needs me to come somewhere to meet him. I'll see you soon. You know, I love you. I love you very much. This is not what I want in my life. So you later, okay? Fina, you have been my best friend from secondary school. Do you know I won't lie to you? Marriage is not easy, yo. Ami, what are you saying? I practically beg for his attention, for everything. I beg Frank to eat my food. I beg Frank to spend time with me at home. I beg him to drop his laptop and just look at me. I even beg him for sex. Are you, are you, are you sure? Are we, are we talking about the same Frank? Frank that was all over you in the village. 
fact that I won't let you breathe. Safe work. Why are you lying? Are you, are you serious? I'm very serious, Frank. Frank has frankly changed. Yes. Uh -uh. Uh -uh. We're not doing that. Please, don't. Help you, Help you, Why? Why? Ma, please now, don't. If you do this, I promise you, I, I, I will leave your house and I will, I, I will not step my foot don't, here again. Don't, please, stop it now. Stop it. Don't go. I'm sorry. I'm going to stop crying, okay? Please. Stop. <laughs> um, is, 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 is my presence reminding you of him? What's going on? I miss him. Okay, I miss him so much. I miss him. You don't understand. I, just... I miss him too. <laughs> it's okay. I'm sorry. I can't pretend anymore. No. <laughs> it's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, honey. Anything the matter? Did I do anything wrong? No, I'm fine. We can actually talk about it. If I did something wrong, please tell me. I'll be in the sitting room. Am I supposed to eat breakfast knowing fully well that something is obviously wrong? You expect me to eat your food? After you cried all night and you still don't want to tell me what the issue is? 
I asked you the last time. You said there was nothing wrong. Are you saying the same thing again? I'm sorry. You see the problem? What exactly are you sorry for? Why are you telling me you're sorry? Why are you acting like I am punishing you in your own house? Punish? No. Honey, you ain't punishing me. I am sorry, okay? It will never happen again. I promise. You either tell me what the issue is, or you leave me with no other option but to talk to your friend Fina about it. Babe, your break, your food. Honey. I was busy in the kitchen. You know the reason I bust out yesterday. And you transferred it to your husband. Kind of. Amara, why don't you want to move on to your life? Why? This is your fault. All of you caused this. You convinced me to marry Frank when to I'm supposed to. To do what? To do what? Try as much as you can and bury the past. You see, what you're doing, you're trying to destroy your marriage that is barely three months old. Yes! So, it's my fault. No, you're blaming me for, for what is going on. No. Mommy, sometimes we have to let go of some things, even when we don't want to. Mommy, what you're doing is not fair on your husband and your marriage. Alright? You think this is easy for me? No, you just talk because talk is cheap. You think it's easy for me. Do you know what? Just know what to tell Frank when he calls again. Excuse me. I'm busy. I'm in. tells me that all is not well with our daughter Amara. You better tell your mind to stop thinking that nonsense. <sighs> but ever since they got married and left, we... It's their honeymoon and when they are doing honeymoon, you don't distract them. <laughs> but, nine, I don't agree with you. I don't agree with you. It's three months, three months already. No calls, no messages. Mm. Nay, nah, I think Amara is angry that we forced her to marry Frank. Hey, woman, stop thinking like that. And stop talking like that also. I am very sure that Amara is happy wherever she is right now. That's all I know. I'm sure she's still thinking about Obiora. No, I don't think so. Because I sat her down and told her that Obiora was gone and gone for good. She's my daughter and she listens to me. Better don't let's talk about this anymore to know so you don't spoil my mood. No, I agree. She's your daughter. But I am a woman. I was once a girl and I was once in love. I know what true love means. Well, what could be her problem? I have no idea. 
But I have invited her friend, Fina, to the office so that we can talk about this. I need to find out why my wife, all of a sudden, cries in the middle of the night. See, I told you to dedicate all your attention to her. Listen, let her tears tell you everything she's bottling inside of her. Ben, I want to ask you an honest question. Go ahead. Are you insinuating that I'm not a good husband to her? Oh, uh, I did not say that. I'm only asking you to try more, my dear friend. Just do more. This is the third time in a row that she's crying in the middle of the night. I'm doing everything I can to pacify her. Um, I buy her expensive gifts. I, I do all. But nothing seems to be working. I think you're in the best position to find out what the problem could be. <laughs> Talking as if you don't know your friend. She's very heady. That's not my friend. Calm down. I... I don't mean it like that. It's okay. You know what? Please take me home. Out, um, I'll see what I can do. I don't know. I'm sorry if I used the wrong word. I shouldn't have said that. I'm sorry. It's fine. It's fine. To make amends. If for any reason she tells you what the issue is, I beg you, please do not hesitate to tell me. Okay, I will talk to her. Thank you. Have a good day. <laughs> now, baby, we cooked up a storm here. This is very good. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I 
Sorry if I have not been performing my conjugal duties. Work has been overwhelming. Okay. But not to worry, I, I promise I'll make it up to you. I will, I promise. Sweetheart. What's wrong with you? Excitedly, I just felt it was, you know, one of those, you know, occurrences. What's going on? No, I can't take this any longer. We have to talk to Father Donald. We need prayers. With me by your side. This time it was so real. I almost called out his name. You need to stop thinking about him. It's not an easy task. It's not easy for me. I'm trying, honestly. It's okay. Just try harder, okay? Don't do that to you. Please don't cry here. Okay. Don't do it. Okay. 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 It's okay. Eh? It's okay. Why not? Baby? What I have on my hand is action. I hope it's not bomb. Yeah, No, I, 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 I,
wasn't among those that laughed. So. Indeed, I saw you laugh. Hmm. And where is your spoon now? Have you shown the same spoon now? Mm -hmm. I won't be using the first spoon. I'll feed you. Or see the one of Everyone <laughs> 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 one of you good cocoa. To date my brother. Ha, I should be thanking you. Hey, your brother is the man of my dreams. You like it? I did it well. You right? connected it very well. Yes! <laughs> I'm the best connector. Oh God, yeah. Of course, you're the best connector. Seriously, Fina. Mm -hmm. Your brother, your brother is. <laughs> he's handsome. Hey, he's caring. He, he's a very good cook. Hey, he's clean. Hmm. And then he helps me do all my assignments as he puts me through. Hey. He's a total package. He's my twin. I know what he can do. Hey. Obi one now. Uh, Obi love. Obi love. Obi love. Obi love. Obi love. I just pray that one day a man like Obi will come and just be showing me all this love. Go away, you're so funny. Don't mm. worry, you find your own love very soon. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> amen, amen. Come, let's go. Yeah, let's go. Let me go and trash you. Oh, forgive you. Just as life and death. When you're mula, when I'm mad, I'm gonna make up. My dear, move on with your life. In this world. I don't feel like going. Me too. <laughs> you are the best thing that has ever happened to me in this village. Sometimes I feel God, God sent you to console my sister and I after the loss of our parents. Please don't speak about that. It will only end up hurting you. Look, I promise you, I will always be by your side, forever, and to always make you happy, and to always love you. <laughs> will you marry me? <laughs> I mean, after school. Yes, I'll marry you. <laughs> Can this be over now? Let's, yeah, let's go home. Please don't mind my sister. <laughs> Girl, I'm not going home. Let's go home. Go, I'm coming. This is mad. Don't worry, I'm already close to the house. You can go. No, I, I don't want to go yet. I want to stay, stay with you. I want you to stay. Uh -uh, stay here. Obi!
Oh, come on. Come on, sir. Please come. Um, did Madame tell you by chance where she was going to? Madame? She know the inside. Is her car in the compound here? What's, what's, look, what, what kind of stupid question are you asking? Weren't you the one that opened the gate for her? Nami? She not tell me where she did go. Come on, please don't get on my nerves. Sorry, sir. I went to see Fina. You went to see Fina? And you're coming back by this time? Why were you avoiding my calls, by the way? Look, I slept off. And when I woke up, I saw you miss calls. I started rushing back home. Babe, I have been home since 2 p.m. Did you forget the appointment with Father Donald? Or you intentionally just avoided the meeting? I did not forget about the meeting. And I am not going anywhere. Don't move. Were you about to walk out on me? What exactly is wrong with you? You've been acting strange lately. What's going on? My darling husband, why don't you ask yourself that question? Hmm? Excuse me. Amara. Amara. Take things easy. No, but mom, am I am trying. I am trying so hard to pretend that my heart belongs to my husband when it belongs to her mother. Mama, you people cost this. You forced me into marrying Frank without even allowing me to mourn. Now, Mama, let me surprise you. Do you know that I have sex with Obiora in my dream more than my own husband? Chimo! Yes. Yes, Mama. God forbid, God forbid, God forbid. Look, Mama, I am enjoying it. There is no union between the living and the dead, Amara Chuku. Mama, Obiora in his death makes me happy. He makes me feel his presence in the house. This is your fault. You people did not allow me to mourn the love of my life. You just pushed me into the man that just showed up. And the next thing, there was canopy chairs and who were they marrying, Amara Chuku. This is your fault! We wanted the best for you. We wanted you to forget to be here as soon as possible. Although I told your father to, to allow you some time. But you know how he is. He's always insisting and will not listen to advice. But whatever happens, what you just told me is not good. We have to do something about it. You know, Mom? Mom, well, it's, it's a little too late because it's already affecting my marriage. And my husband does not care. The only thing he cares about is work, work, and more work. Where are you going to? Hold your own grave to tidy it and leave some flowers. Hey, Amara, you could help yourself now. This is this is this is not what you're supposed to be doing. Visiting Obiora grave is not part of it. Mama, 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 please, just leave me alone. I am not only going to go to Obiora's grave. I am going to spend some time there, quality time. 
So don't even think I'm coming back any any anytime soon. <laughs> oh, Mama, oh, no. Allow Obiara to rest in peace, Amara. Hey! My dear, move on with your life. Life is just a stage where everybody comes and perform. After which, they go back to their destination. Um, a friend just called me that Amara called him to say that he will not be coming home. Why? No, I think you should ask Amara when she gets back. You are her mother. And she would have told you everything. Nay, please. I don't have the strength to argue. Just let me be. Be gone. She is not sleeping here tonight. Makagini. Eh? Why? In her father's compound? She should go to her husband. Are you driving your only daughter away? No, I'm only saying she should go to her matrimonial home. Huh. I think you should allow her to relax for a while. Besides, I miss her so much. If she wants to spend some time with us, just let her be, please. You see, you are the one instigating her. You are the one making her to come out of her matrimonial home to stay with you. Nay, why are you talking like this? Anyway, as you can see, I'm very tired. I don't, I'm, I'm in no mood for your arguments. Please, when your daughter comes, you face us well. I need to go and rest. How can she say she's not going back home? A newly married woman. This is not what I want in my life. I'm just Life is just a stage where everybody comes and perform. After which, they go back to their destination. Don't allow your pastor in your life because light and darkness has nothing in common, just as life and death. When you're when I'm mad, I'm my dear, move on with your life.
Frank. You mean she traveled to the village? She did not tell me anything. Okay. I will call her and get back to you. Alright. Um, let me try and call her, okay? Hello, Fida. Frank. Did she take your call? Hi, sorry. I have not been able to reach her. Yes, but I'll keep trying. Okay, please just relax. As soon as I hear from her, I will call you back. Please. Okay, that's fine. That's all right. Thank you very much for your help. All right, I really appreciate it.
2 raised to the power 4 times 2. 2 times 4. 8. 8. So divided by 2 square raised to the power 4. Very simple. That's it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it just made it so easy. Mm -hmm. Just apply Charles law. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> it's something as simultaneous equation. Just know when to break. You just made it easier. I've been cracked. Honey, hmm? can I ask you a question? Yeah, sure, go on. After the death of your parents, why did you stay back in the village? You're very brilliant. You could have come back to the city to take your jam. Hmm? Oh, to tell you the truth, I, I took that decision because I want to be closer to you. I don't want to stay a day without you by my side. My love. But that's a huge sacrifice. That is too much. You you're so intelligent. Shh. Nothing is too much for you. Meanwhile, remember what I said about your nose ring. Do not take it off. Okay. I love it, okay? <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> okay. Right. So this one you use board mass. Hmm? Board mass, you know what that bracket of division. Open. What? Meat. Open your mouth. I took it when Mama was in. Watching. Don't steal again. Okay, I won't. You're working really hard. Don't know. Oh, let me go back for Mama will notice. I was trying to make fish pepper soup for you. You made fish pepper soup for me? Mm -hmm. Oh, baby, do you have to make something for me each time we see? Because mm -hmm. I promised that I will always be your chef. Thank you. I made something for you too. Yeah, okwa. Mm. Thank you, my love. You're welcome. And thank you for making this fish pepper soup for me. But, my love, you have to stop flattering me with your cooking. I am the woman. Allow me to cook. Hmm? And who says cooking is meant for women alone? Men also cook. <laughs> oh, this is good. I am suspecting something about my mother. What could that be? That she knows that the school does not conduct lessons on Saturday. And that we came up with this curriculum because we needed to spend time together. Your mom is not so smart to have known that. That means you must have given her the impression. You weren't careful enough. Maybe. Do you know it's hard to stay without you? A day without seeing you, it's, it's like living in hell. So, maybe. Same here. A day without you, 
always looks like I lost something. I yet to find it. <laughs> Let us eat. Yes. Let ah. us eat my opera. Sometimes when when um, uh, delivery is not due, mm. like in human beings, you put them in incubator. Exactly, mm. in human yeah. beings, it's nine months or even yeah. so you put them in incubators for them to you know get not sure, sure. get better. Exactly. Wow, so that's what you're saying. Mm. Okay, yes, exactly the definition. So even in even in animals, they also have their own. Like uh, when eggs are not properly hatched, you incubate it. You have to incubate it. Thank you. Thank you. You have it. <laughs> okay. so, so you have to put incubator here and explain it. Now you understand the meaning. Then uh, this one is tractor. He's trying to tell us the works of tractors. Okay. You know, sometimes when jobs are too much okay. for humans okay. to do or to bring in tractors for them to make it easier for make them. Make it easier for them to. But yeah. is to draw the tractor. That's the problem. Yes, <laughs> but we will we'll, we'll do it. Though. Yes. Okay. Yeah. So, see, I think there's so oh, okay. There's even a big picture. You feel that picture? Of... These two children are so amazing. The most interesting part of it is that their relationship has really helped in Ad uh, Amarashi's academic performance. I, I, I don't trust the two boys. Huh? Yes. Immediately he gets what he's looking for. He goes to the next vulnerable village girl. Ah. No, nah, but they didn't start their friendship today. They've been close for no less than three years now. And it keeps coming. And coming because uh, <laughs> my daughter have not uh, let him see her plan. Uh, don't, don't be carried away by the pretense that you are seeing there. I'm not sure he means well for her daughter. Uh, no. I have an ob objection on that. Uh, can you say that? Have you forgotten so soon that it was this same boy, this same Uviora? That helped her daughter in her Wayek exam. And she did so well. Now she's preparing for her jam. He's there. Eh? In fact, for her to even sit down and think of studying, reading and all that. Is the hard work of Obiora. You should be happy for them. Of nah. course I am happy. You know, I am also happy for her academic improvement. But uh, I, <laughs> I doubt the outcome of this relationship. You may not like what I'm saying, but I'm a man and I know what I'm saying. Hmm. Nah, I care what I to go. That's your own business, so all I know is that they are doing, they are, they are, they are good together. <laughs> Obim, Obim, you've been quiet. You haven't said anything since I got here. What is the problem? Hmm? Your father. My father? What did my father do? My 
father told me to stop coming to the house to see you. What? My father said that to you? Yes, he said that, but I'm not surprised. I know he has always detested me. Oh, babe. Do you know my mother loves you? My mother is in support of our relationship. So if my father is acting this way, it shouldn't bother you. It's just a matter of time. Huh? I'm worried. Please. Don't be worried. We have come too far to turn around now. Okay? Everything will be fine. Besides, remember we have jump to rights by next month. Hmm? Okay. No matter what, I will always love you. Nothing will ever stop me from loving you. I love you too. I love you more. Where did she leave all these things? Why is Amara Ah! Uh -uh. Oh! Amara! Amara Chuku! She didn't give me. Where did, has this girl gone to? This is why her father will keep blaming me for not training her well. But God knows I'm doing my best. How can she live everywhere like this and just, and just, and just... Amara Chukwu! Amara! Hey, Chibo! Papa, good afternoon, Ma. Where are you coming from? Um, I, I. Amara Chukwu, where are you coming from? I. I, 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 I Come, I, I, let me see that thing in your hand. Papa, look at the, look at, look at, look at the clothes we were supposed to wash. Are you not the one that brought out these clothes out? You wanted to wash them, isn't it? Yes, so what happened? All of a sudden, you just disappeared. Sorry. So only God knows where. You're coming back this afternoon. Amara, where are you coming from? Well, I'm so sorry. Let me just go and start washing. No need. It's already afternoon. Can't you see the sun is at the center? Don't wash for me again. Let me have that thing in your hand. Hey, Mama. Hey. Have you started stealing? Hey! You stole something from someone. No, Mama. I've never, I've never stolen anything in my life. Let me have it. Marachu, <laughs> what is this? Your pants stained with blood. What did you do? Huh? What have you done? 
What are you doing? <laughs> Have you done it? Hey! Amara! Amara, she could. Why? Why is she terrible? Just kill me. I'm sorry. Amara, she could just kill me. Why? Why did you do this to me? Amara, she could. This is what I taught you. Oh, I'm a princess. I'm sorry. Oh. Hey, I want to kill you. I want to just kill you. Let me die. Kill me. I want to kill you. So after all my several warnings, oh, oh, my God. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It was a mistake. I'm sorry. It's it's more I'm sorry. I'm a Who would the flower do today? It's Obiora. What? Obiora. Hi. This is Obiora. I was defending both of you before your father. Ha! Huh. Why now? Why? I'm sorry, because I'm sorry. Okay. Did he did he force you? No. He did not force you. No, Mama, he didn't force me. The both of us agreed to do it today. <laughs> <laughs> Now nah, this girl has finished me. This girl has finished me. Mama, 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 kill me, please. That has still not answered my question. I do know that the meeting money that they gave me, and I gave it to Amara to keep for me. She has lost it. The Amarachi that we know is very careful. What was my, my mistake? Which mistake? So how much is it? 3,000 Naira! A whole 3,000 Naira! Three, one, two, three thousand Naira! This girl! Very careless and stupid! 3,000 Naira? And you kept Amarachi kneeling down? You make my only daughter to kneel down because of 3,000 naira? You double the money. Huh? Yes, I will double the money. Now, go and get me food to eat. Get up, go get me food. You should give me my money, oh. I want my money now. Go get me food. That, that money is, is for meeting people, oh. I want to return it to them, oh. I want you to stop this nonsense. Don't you ever treat my only daughter that way. Nah, you're spoiling, you're spoiling her, you? You're spoiling her. This is not good. Uh, that money does not belong to me. You want them to disgrace me? Give me the money. If you say you're doubling it, let me have it. What do you mean I am spoiling her? You humiliating my only daughter, you are telling me. I, 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 what are you talking about? Amarachi is careless. I'm only teaching her a lesson. How do you feel now? I feel a bit better. Has the blood stopped? No, no, no. Okay, I bought medicine for you. Please, keep it out of your father's reach. It will help relieve the pain and stop the bleeding. Okay, you know? And since you've eaten already, just take it and sleep. Thank you. Hey, Mama. Thank you for not telling Papa. Thank you. It's okay. But that does not mean I've given you license to come be flirting with Obiora. No, no. Mama, I promise you it will never happen again. Because... And that reminds me, I'm going to talk to Obiora. Oh yeah, take this thing now. Then you don't hide it. Put the back there. You hear me?
I'm sorry. I've been worried about you, knowing that I put you through this. Obi, okay, it's okay. Did your mom notice? My love, I'm talking to you. Do you love me? I mean, do you really love me or it's just my body that you oh, love? I love you. I love you so much, even in death. I will still love you. Even in death? I will always love you, my love. Well, my mom knows we did it. What? Please, just calm down, okay? Everything is under control, I promise you. Okay, I'm, I'm really sorry for everything. No, it's okay. It's not your fault. I wanted it to. Amara. Hi, Mama. You're back. I only came to check up on you. Uh, uh, good night. I... Uncle say about our jam fee. Mm -hmm. He gave us the money. <laughs> <laughs> we are right in our jam course. I will not the fact. My love, you okay? Our wife, you look so unhappy. Fina, please excuse us. Okay. Um, uh, hey, Obi, try and make her happy, oh. Why did you do that? Obi, I'm sorry. But I won't be writing the exam with two people this year. Why? My father. He said he does not have money. My mom is still trying to come up with something. But they are trying to make me understand that I will take the exam next year. No, that will not be possible. You can't take the exams next year. You must write with us. How? You don't understand. There is no money. Okay, don't, don't worry, okay? Don't don't cry. We'll, we'll look for a way around it. No? It's okay. Good 
Good well, afternoon, sir. Who are you? Sir, um, I'm Obiora. Obiora, the one you know. Yes. Obiora, I know. I remember vividly telling him not to step his foot in my compound. By the way, uh, I wonder why I, I, I'm finding it hard to believe the testimonies that my wife talks about you. Yeah. Obi. I'm sorry, I'll be alright. Nay, what is it now? What is it? Leave them alone. Can I see? I want to see her. Yeah. I leave these children alone. Okay, come. There's something I want to tell you. Come, let's go inside. Ah, I see if you didn't play love when you were small. Be a mokem. Get all this money from? Huh? Does it matter? What matters is that you're finally writing the exam with us. Of course, it matters. I need to know. Okay, I went to meet my uncle, so I lied to him that Fina lost the, the the money he gave her for exams, so he gave me another one. Bim, did you have to lie? But I had no option. I understand. Thank you. Thank you for all you do for me. Thank you for all the sacrifices. Thank you for being my knight in shiny armor. <laughs> <laughs> you don't need to thank me. I'm glad that you're finally going to write the exams with us. I love you so much. I love you more. <laughs> I love you more. I miss you. Miss you, miss you, miss you, so much. You know, I, I vowed to your mother that I'm not going to touch you again till we get married. But I need you. I, I miss you. I miss what we had. But we have to hold ourselves, okay? Very soon, we'll be done with our school. And then, we'll settle down. It's a long time from now, but... Let's get to the university first. Okay. <laughs> Can I at least hug you again? Of course. <laughs> <laughs> okay. He's not sure. He's not sure. Yeah. You know I'm not troublesome. I know, but it was so scary. You know, when I woke up, I almost peed on my pants out of fear. It's okay. It was just a dream. Okay? Nothing will happen to us. Hmm? <sighs> okay. <laughs> so what are you up to this Saturday? Ah, <sighs> fam. 
Will you come and help me? <laughs> Just say you miss me and you want to see my face. Yes, I miss you and I want to see <laughs> your face. <laughs> okay, I'll come. Me and my twin sister will come. Okay, I'll mm. be expecting you both. Okay? Um, let me go and get ready, okay? I'll see you later. Thank you. <laughs> I just wanted to make sure you are okay. I'm fine. I'm okay. Okay, go. Remember my Opa. Okay. Mama, what is bringing this overwhelming joy? Eh? Mama, nothing. I am just happy. I know that smile. I know that smile. The first time I felt it was when I met your father. Mama! <laughs> mm -hmm. It comes when you've met someone you're fond of. <laughs> no one don't want to walk. What is it now? Stop eavesdropping on our conversation. Ah, this is women to women gist. Mama, good afternoon. 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 Mama, Hey, you are your big sister. Hey! I'm fine, Mama. You are fine, Mama. What are you doing here? Uh, I'm just passing by. I saw you, so I wanted so, to help you. Hey, that's nice. <laughs> <laughs> Papa, let me help you. Hey! Where is the Oh, let me help you. Hey! Okay? Hey, you're fine. Hey, you're fine. Hey, you're fine. Please be careful, oh. Yeah, hey, Mama. Don't worry. Don't worry, oh. They are strong. How are you now? I'm fine. chance to survive is 50-50 because the venom has gone down his blood. But notwithstanding, I'm going to do all that is humanly and professionally possible to save his life. Okay? Please, try all you can to keep him alive. Biko, please. Okay, ma. Remember, we only treat God heals. He'll be fine. It's something that, that has to do with life. You can, you can take my hand and replace him. So it has no body to die. It has no body to die. You okay. Calm down. Just calm down. Chuku. Is he giving? It has no body to die. Eh? Right. Ah, Amara Chuku. Please, you are all I have. Don't say that again. Mama, please don't tell me that. No, don't tell me. Okay, okay. Oh my God. Please, oh young my God. Young lady, please. If I had known, I would have allowed him to come to the room. I would have allowed him. Oh. Please, this is a hospital. You are disturbing other patients. I told you he will be fine. Okay? You want to see me outside? Alright, why not? Let's go. <laughs> Okay. 
around him. And if he dies, my daughter's life is going to be miserable. But she's the only one I have. I don't have any other child. Please save his life for my daughter's sake, please. Mazi, calm down. Are you calm? Yes, I could be. Good. Like I said, it's 50-50. You see, we only treat but God heals. All right? What I'm going to do for you now is I am going to do all that is humanly possible to save his life. Doctor, money, money. I, I have money. I have properties I can sell and... I, just, don't, just, just don't let him die, please. Mozzie, stop panicking. It's fine. It's fine, all right? We treat, but God heals. Stop panicking. It's fine. It wasn't. It wasn't that. It wasn't that. It wasn't that. It wasn't that. to die. So don't kill yourself for nothing. Ma, Ma you will not understand. I understand everything. See, the only thing you need to do for him now is to pray for him. Am I confused? I don't even know what to think anymore. My heart is heavy. And the old man, the old man is terrible. I was just coming back from the farm to get our machetes and home. On my way back, I saw this black ugly cat that almost ran across my leg. Mama, I know it. Because I have seen it before. The last time I saw it, Grandma died. I am scared. No, 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 no. To be. Okay? See, I think you are just being deleted by things. Nothing is going to happen. And seeing a cat is not a bad sign. It's okay, it's okay, stop crying. It's okay. You need to be strong for Biora. You need to be strong for him, okay? Let's go inside. It's okay. It's alright. Trying to get your attention. I'm sorry, my mind is my mind is where uh, I'm going to. Oh, okay. My name is Frank. Uh, Frank Daniels. Are you from this village? Yes. Please, may I continue? I'm going somewhere. You seem disturbed. Is everything okay? Please, can I just go? All right. Just tell me your name, at least. Just tell me your name, okay? Please, some other time. Okay. What about your number? Hello. Very beautiful. I'll try and get to know her.
Thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Call to your evil name. Yes. Like Papa do call me if he and Mama will call me a former or female. I'm going to join them soon. Please don't say that to me. Please, please don't say it. Who will be my twin? Who will defend me? Who will be my backbone? Baby, you can't leave me in this wicked world, please. Please. Tamara will be there for you. I don't want anybody. I don't want Tamara. I just want you. Oh, baby. Come on. Try to stay strong. Try. <laughs> pain is too much. Oh, baby. Come, please, baby. Try. Try. The pain is taking me away to join our parents. Um, what is going on here? I'm sorry I lied to you. She lied to me. Lied to you about. I lied to you about the jam. I did not register for the jam. It doesn't even matter. Why, why are you telling me now? Why? Because I want you to be happy. Yes. I wanted you to write this here. While I will register for mine next year. It's okay. Just rest, okay? Just rest. I want you to be strong. No. No, you, you know I can't be strong. You know, you know you are my strength, right? You know that. You like fish with this soup, <laughs> right? Yes. You know, you know I like it very much. I'll be your chef. <laughs> I'll always be your chef. Yes, you'll be. Yes, you'll be my chef. You'll be my everything. Okay? <laughs> No, 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 good night. There's no, good night. Okay, we're not sleeping yet. We're not sleeping, so we're not sleeping. Oh, 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 we're not s
I didn't say that now. Uh, but he still sleeps with you in the dream, isn't it? Yes, but not tormenting me. It's different. Marachu, it has to stop. What? Yes, it has to stop. You can't continue like this. You need to have your own child and make a family. Look, it's a taboo to be having sex in the dream. Worst of it all, a dead person. Mbana. It has to stop. Mama. <laughs> Before you mama me, I got something. This is for you have to use it. Use it. Use it and block your private parts. That way, he won't be able to penetrate you again. Yes. Mama, I feel his presence all around me. Of course. You have to shun him from coming to you. Yes. Besides, you still care for his presence, isn't it? Mama, I miss him. You he see? was my first love, but it's not easy for me. I miss him. It's okay, Mama. It's okay. I understand. I'm going to be happy with this. It's alright. Okay, I understand how you feel. But you see, you can't continue like this. There's a thick line between the living and the dead. Please, you need to move on. You need to leave. Use this. Use it for yourself. Use it for us. Yes. Okay. You can continue to grieve. You continue to grieve for his presence. He'll keep on tormenting you. And it's no good. Oh, wow. Please make sure you use this. Huh? Everything will be fine. Thank you. Use that thing. Hmm? 
You used it. You fixed it. Right. That's good. Um, your husband is here. This early. <laughs> He's outside with your father drinking tongue wine. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Please come and greet him. Okay, Mama. I'm coming back. Okay. Right. Thank you for the meeting, Oh. <laughs> so you mean you you left us about as early as Friday? Oh yes, my the taxi driver was really fast. <laughs> and what's the time now? Oh, it's actually past eight. Ah. I just think he wasn't speed, you know. <laughs> he was just taking it gently, gently. Yeah. <laughs> All the same. Yeah. You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. <laughs> No, no. no. <laughs> oh, you're welcome, eh? Thank you very much. Mm. Uh, your wife will soon be here. Okay, thank you. Until I enjoy you. You are thinking our money too. Yeah, enjoy. My love, I hope you enjoy it. Ah, of course. Hey, hey. Atalu, my mama. Huh? I've been calling you since. You got me really worried. You're not taking my calls. Husband of the year. And you had to drive all the way from the city because I wasn't picking you. Hmm? Amarachu. Amarachu, you are talking to your husband. Why not? Huh? Don't worry yourself. Take her with you. She's just a child. <laughs> Can you please just stop acting as if you're some caring husband? Go on. Come on. Talk to your daughter. Talk to her. You better go and drive your husband back to the city. Papa, that is all you have to say. No problem. I will follow my husband back to the city. Why he sits here to pretend as if he's a dove, and when we get back to the city, he turns into a vulture. Papa, uh, right, stop talking like this now. I'm not a terrible person. Okay. Whatever I did to you, I am sorry. Please, I apologize. Forgive me. Eh? It will not happen again. I, I, I promise you, I will make amends. It's okay. It's okay. A young man that left the city as early as 5 a.m. to look for his beloved wife is a son-in-law that any man will go for. Thank you, sir. Take your wife. That's where she belongs. Stand up and go and carry your wife. She's your property. Give me this. If there's any way I have wronged you, find it in your heart to forgive me. I'm sorry. You have said that a thousand times in the village, and I hear you loud and clear. I know you're so angry. And I want things to go back to the way it used to be. I want to make you happy. You are all that I have. Please. I can't, I can't continue like this. I need you back. Please. I have. 
have missed hearing those words from you. Come here. Why don't I quickly brush in and make something for us to eat? No. Why don't we rush in into the kitchen together and make something for both of us to eat? Now, that's my husband talking. <laughs> <laughs> Having for dinner, you're yeah, having tomato sauce, tomato sauce, and yam, right? Mm -mm. And plantain, plantain, my favorite. I know, I know. <laughs> let me help you. Oh, let me oh, stop. No, 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 no. I don't want you to do anything, I just want you to stay right here, yeah, mm -hmm. and watch your wife cook. Are you serious? Mm -hmm. So, we're just gonna chat. Yes, this is what you want. Keep me company, it's like your buddy, right? <laughs> So, how was your unannounced trip to the village? It was epic. I don't want to talk about it. You bounced my call. I am sorry. Please, forgive me. It's okay. <laughs> With the look of things, I can see that you and Frank are getting along. Well, he's been trying to be a good husband lately. Okay. That's good. Listen, trust me, he will do better. Okay, just give him a chance. Please. Anyways, I have to. Oh. No, I know it's that part not here. I have to go. No. <laughs> no. You know I love you very much, right? I love you too. I'll see you soon. I'll call you. Okay. I'll call you. Okay. I will call you. Trust me. Everything will be okay. Okay. <laughs> Bye. Bye.
Probeer. My name is Frank. How can I be your Obim and you're depriving me from having you? Obim, you look very angry. I promised you that I will love you even in death. You caused my death and now you're running away from me? you every night making love to him and when you're done you hinder me from coming to you how selfish can you be thank you just calm down calm down okay i love you right but you are dead and we can't keep doing this it is ruining my family please understand me i beg you I regret helping your father on that fateful day. Now all I feel is pain, grief, and agony piercing through my heart. I will never give up. I will never, ever give up on you if you continue to prevent me from coming to you then it will be disastrous i will cause your husband an irreplaceable loss i will crumble your marriage this is not threat i mean it Block him from making love to me. <sighs> but my brother was my brother was not a sex freak. <sighs> so what is going on? I'm as confused as you are. Yes, so we already flowered me. But after that one time, we never had it again. And anytime I see him in my dream, there's this anger in his eyes. This is serious. I don't know what to do. Have you told your husband or anybody else? Hell no. I, I can't even do that. It, it sounds crazy and funny. It's really crazy. Hey. Mm. Don't worry. I promise you we'll find a solution to this problem. But for now, please, continue me in that path to sleep. I know that Ubira will never hurt you. Okay? Hmm? She reported me to you, right? Okay. She's breaking my heart the more. 
Obi, you are dead. Try and understand that the spirits have nothing to What has come over you? The twin brother I know would never lay a hand on me. Who are you? Tell her I will strike she and her husband to ashes if she continues to deprive me of her body. She belongs to me. No one else. Obi, Obi, we are peaceful people. The brother I know is very peaceful and friendly. Obi, because they are no. She is mine and mine forever. I won't want her again. Obi, be gone. Obi, be gone. One be gone. Obi! 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 Did. It's okay. I promise it's not going to happen again till we get married. But I promise. And also, promise me you're not going to tell your mother about what just happened. I'll try. Promise. I love you so much. First. Okay. Remember your nylon. Ah, I'll get it. I'm okay. Um, are we still going for the date? I forgot. I'm so sorry. You know what? Um, just give me five minutes to freshen up and I'll be back. Um, um just let's go inside. Okay. All right. Life is just a stage where everybody comes and performs. After which, they go back to 
your destination. Don't allow your pastor in your life. Because light and darkness has nothing in common. Just as life and death. When you are my dear, move on with your life. Life is just a stage. Where everybody comes and perform. After which they go back to their destination. Don't allow your pastor in your life. Because light and darkness has nothing in common. Just as life and death. One year wula wuna made my dear, move on with your life.